hot. Ugh, it's actually colder in Florida right now. What's up YouTube? I'm Rob with Useless Hobby Limited and today I am in another state, another place, and a completely different location than I normally am. I am in beautiful, sunny Los Angeles. I'm a filmmaker by trade and I uh, sometimes get called to do gigs out of town. And this one was pretty fun for the most part. And um, I got to coincide it with some meetings, and so it was even better. Blake and I lived out here for a number of years. She lived out here for four, and I lived out here for three. And uh, it was freaking dope. Not easy for sure. Um, things here are a little pricier than they are in Ocala, Florida, but it was worth it. Got to see all these cool underground indie bands. We got to watch all different types of like weird, interesting, independent films that don't get a wide release. Movie premieres, exciting events and stuff like that. But I think the biggest thing that we missed from Los Angeles is the food. I cannot tell you the amount of places that uh, she and I have gone to in Los Angeles over the years. It's probably where we spent a lot of our money. I'm probably only gonna really have time to make one video. Unfortunately, I just, I'm not here for that long and I, I do have to work. I wanted to kind of just do something that was kind of in our realm. So Blake and I both would go to this place in Culver City called the Honey Kettle. Really great fried chicken. Heading directions to Honey's Kettle Fresh Fried Chicken. Wait, did she say rod? Those jerks. She did say a rod. We have hot sauce and honey. Help yourself. The honey's kettle fries are masterfully created. They have a nice light brown crispiness on the outside and they are very fluffy on the inside. That's a place that likes to add a lot of salt. Every part of it is salty and savory. They are very well-made fries. The chicken has the perfect juicy to crispy ratio. And even though it's like has clearly dark meat, still very fresh. Now here's the reason why this restaurant's called the Honey Kettle. Honey's Kettle's biscuits are legendary. They are literally from the heavens. They have the perfect buttery kind of sweet taste to them but what's cool about them is that you can pair them with both sweet and savory options you can either use them to eat your chicken tenders and kind of make a little sandwich or you can dunk them in honey and have a nice little sweet treat while you're eating your chicken either way it works i recommend doing a little mixture of both and you will have a great time fries dipped in honey are a weird idea but kind of like dipping your fries in like a milkshake I've never tried this before, so let's see how this goes. Hot sauce. Mm. I'd give this hot sauce about 2.5 on the spiciness meter. It's got a nice kick, but it's not gonna overwhelm the rest of what the chicken and biscuits have to offer. Well, I am officially in a food coma. Um, I don't really feel the need to rate Honey Kettle, but just for the sake of posterity, I give it a five out of five. It's one of the best places in LA. But that's it for uh, me and the Honey Kettle. Hopefully I'll be able to make one or two more videos in LA. If not, this is it, and I'll just have to wait till I get back next time. Hope you guys have a lovely day, and may the wind be at your back.